What if I told you I found a web design job for $35,000 all using AI? Would you really even believe me? AI isn't replacing people who know what they're doing. It's replacing people who don't. Right now, a lot of the internet, especially YouTube, is filled with just a bunch of AI hype. I'm gonna show you five real modern ways people are making money with AI, including myself, not by guessing, not by chasing trends, but by building simple systems around demand that already exists. I recently found companies looking to hire using AI and their budgets range from $30,000 all the way to about $100,000. How did I do this? Well, I built an AI workflow and don't worry, I'll show you this workflow in just a bit. So with that said, let's just get into these five ways on how you can make money with AI. Now, the first method is actually quite simple. Build an AI lead generation system for yourself or for other businesses. The fastest way to make money right now with AI is lead generation, but not the spammy version. Forget cold buying email lists, forget cold blasting customers. Modern lead generation is about finding people who are already about to spend money. Here's an example. When a company posts a request for proposal, they're literally saying, we have a budget of $20,000. We need help with something, so pitch us an offer. Do you guys wanna see one? Let me show you some that I found with AI. So here's a website that we currently found using AI automation. Now here you'll see that they are requesting for someone to help design their websites and their budget ranges from about 30,000 euros, which is about 35,000 K. Now here you'll see they want you to use WordPress, they want you to use WooCommerce, and these are like simple things anybody can do. But the thing is, you probably even never heard about this website. I myself, I did not either, but we've developed an AI workflow that pulls all this information from the internet and it places in a Google Sheets or an Excel spreadsheet. Another website that we found was this one right here. Another website you probably never heard about, Central Coast Community Energy, and it is an organization. And you're gonna see that they are offering a request for a proposal. And here it is. So they are requesting people to uh, design their websites, hosting, maintenance, and support services. And you'll see right now, the release date was December 18th, 2025. And the proposal deadline was the 21st of next year. So as of right now, this is open for bids and anyone can bid on this job. Another one that we found, uh, this one wasn't worth that much money, but it was worth about five grand, you know? So they're, they're offering a... Uh, they're offering about twenty-five dollars to $5,000 for a web design overhaul. And this is the workflow that we designed in order to scrape leads to the internet. Now, to be honest, this is really not even a complex workflow. Anyone out here can make this. And essentially what we did was we have this formula here where every two hours we're fetching stuff throughout the internet, we're scraping information, and we're looking for keywords like request for proposal, web design, leads, and something else. Now, if you are in any sort of niche, if you are in restaurants or if you are in in the dog industry, you know, pet grooming, you can make the same exact workflow for any type of niche. So it doesn't have to be for web design. It could be for anything to find jobs. Now, in case you want to know how we made this, we actually made this with NADN. So NADN is an automation platform where essentially you can automate tasks and everything else. If you want to learn more about this, I have a free tutorial in the video description that I'll walk you through how to use NADN. It's not that difficult. It does take some time to learn. Now, if you want to learn a lot more about NADN, we actually have a school dedicated uh, that will teach people how to use NADN. And we have a very large classroom. We have about like 60 or 70 courses. And for those of you watching it thinking, oh, you're just trying to sell something, guys, the school is only like $29. It is like dirt cheap. So yeah, you're getting a lot of value. AI automation reads job post boards, Reddit posts, requests for proposals, and public listings from government jobs. Automation tools like NADN collect those posts, filter out all the junk, and then compiles a list of companies right now that are actively hiring and looking for help. And here's the thing, businesses love warm leads. In fact, if you find one job using this system, everything's already paid for itself. So like I mentioned before, you can either take these leads and participate in the jobs yourself, or you can actually sell these leads to customers who are interested. Next up, we have method two, creating affiliate marketing websites that people actually use. Affiliate marketing still works, but the old way is dying fast. Writing blog posts like top 10 best whatever just doesn't hit like it used to because AI summaries now answer questions before even people click on your websites. So here's the smarter move. Instead of writing an opinion or review about a product where everyone knows you're just gonna try to sell them, why don't you make a tool that people can actually use? Here's an example. Instead of writing a blog post about currency exchange, how about you build a website that shows live exchange rates? You show the spreads of currencies, you show the fees from different websites, you show a service that is cheapest right now. And right next to those exchange rates, you can add a link to either wise.com because they have an affiliate program or something like Revolt. And I've actually made one of these. Let me show you. So here it is. Actually, no, this is actually my cryptocurrency one that I'm gonna show you next. So here's the AI website that I created all using AI. Now here you'll see that uh, if someone sends a thousand US dollars to Thailand, they're gonna get about 31,000 Thai bots. 
And here is the actual live rate, and you can see it's actually pulling from real time. So that's actually today, so the 23rd and also the 23rd. Here we can see the uh, live exchange rate trends where it shows us the trends of the actual currency with the Euro and also the Thai bot. And scrolling down, you'll also see that we have the top 20 most popular currency pairs like USD to Thai bots, Euro, British pound, etc. And if I go ahead and change this to, you know, 1500, you'll also see this amount automatically changes. Once the user kind of gets an idea of like, what's the best rate for them right here, if they click on wise.com, it'll actually take them to wise where they can go ahead and sign up, make an account, and then you can make a commission with wise, or you can sign up for a service like revolt as well. And they also can exchange money for your users. So essentially you're creating something that people can actually use instead of writing opinions like, oh, wise review, you know, my favorite exchange or something, right? So here's my website, CoinSignal. And what this website does is it breaks down all the coins in an analysis and it uses AI for this and it predicts whether you should buy it, sell it, hold it, or just be cautious. Here you'll see that it has a lot of neutral positions where it's saying we're not really sure. It has the buy signals, neutral. Uh, here, this one says hold. I actually own Polygon, so I do hope this one goes up in the near future. Uh, Shibu, also, this one says hold. And as you scroll down, it'll just give you more analysis on a lot of these coins. Now, if I were to go ahead and just click on one of these, let's take a look at uh, Stellar right here. I'll click on Stellar. So right now, Stellar, it's about 21 cents. And if we scroll down, you'll see that the recommendation is buy. Now, I do need to fix the overall score. It is a little weird, right? It's 305 out of 100, so I got to tweak that. The risk level is medium and explains why. So reasons to buy right here, risk and concerns, and then the technical analysis. Now the whole point of this is to make affiliate commissions from Coinbase and also Binance. So if the user reads this and they're saying, you know what, I think this is a good investment, I wanna go ahead and buy it. Here they can go ahead and click on Coinbase. And what's really cool is it'll redirect them to Coinbase where they can go ahead and buy Stellar right here in their accounts. Also, what's really awesome about AI is all you gotta do is give them one affiliate link. The AI will actually place the affiliate link on all the buttons so you don't have to place each one individually, which is gonna save you a lot of time. Now, many people ask me, well, these apps are cool and everything, Daryl, but how do I get traffic to my app? I personally recommend video content. I think making videos around this specific topic for your viewers and then redirecting to this website, those are probably the best ways to go. And the second way is to build backlinks. So you'll have to hire an SEO company to start building backlinks and start that SEO grind. Method three, which is actually quite simple, is selling AI websites. A majority of small business websites are outdated, slow, and even terrible on mobile. So instead of pitching web design services from scratch, you flip the process. You build pre-made websites for specific niches like dentists, gyms, restaurants, or lawyers. Then you find businesses whose current websites clearly need help. I actually made a video that has about 100,000 views that'll actually show you how to do this, but let me just give you a brief overview. So here's a video that I created, and in this video, I use Hosting or Horizons. Now you're gonna see that uh, it has a lot of views, has a lot of likes, and people found this really helpful. And essentially in this video, what I do is I teach them how to create AI websites and then pitch it to actual local clients. And guys, I've been in web design for like 10 years, so I know how clients work. I know the best target audience, so I do recommend to watch this before you jump into you know, making AI websites and try to sell them. So essentially what I do here is I basically make a quick AI website using Lovable or Hosting or Horizons, or it could be any sort of AI builder. And here is the actual website live on a domain. And essentially what we do here is we actually go scour the actual uh, Google Maps. For example, here we found this one website, Fit Factory Nashville, and I'll go ahead and click on this. And I would clearly say that this is actually a candidate. It's a really ugly looking website. So what I would do here is I would essentially take their logo, I would slap it on this AI website, shoot them an email and say, hey, what about this website? Would you guys like to have a website that looks like this? It'll only cost you $200. Now I know that sounds like not a lot of money, but I do have a pricing package right here that I'll show you why we price it like that. Essentially you're putting them on a monthly subscription. So that way you can get recurring revenue from your websites. The benefit to using AI in this case is you're not selling a concept. You're showing a finished product. AI helps you generate copies, layouts and variations quickly. So you can put out more websites and attract more clients with AI instead of building it all from scratch. AI automation helps you deploy fast. This removes fear, reduces back and forth, and closes the deal faster than traditional freelancing. Method four, which is actually quite popular on Upwork, is selling AI workflows. This is one of the most underrated AI business models. Instead of selling your time, you can sell your systems. With tools like NNN and AI, you can build workflows that businesses rely on every single day. 
For example, imagine an agency that gets tons of inquiries but doesn't know which ones are serious. You build a workflow that automatically reads incoming messages, identifies business size, scores urgency, and flags hot leads. So I'm personally working with someone right now that sold an AI workflow for about $5,000. And what it does is it scrapes menu items from restaurants in their local community. Why would they want to scrape menu items from other restaurants? Well, here's the truth. Number one is competitor menu analysis. They can scrape menu items to see how effective the menus are and how broad the other selections are. Number two is trend notification. Restaurants can use this insights to get ideas on trending foods or other restaurants best sellers. And number three is price intelligence. Restaurants can price accordingly based on other restaurants in the area. And once a business relies on a system like this, they're not gonna cancel easy. Next up is method five. And this one's actually quite popular. is selling AI apps or monetize them yourself. Finally, let's talk about apps. You don't need to build the next multi-billion dollar platform. The money is in small, focused AI apps that solve annoying problems really well. Think of tools like website audit apps, proposal generators, review response tools, and appointment follow-up systems. I made an app that converts JPEG to PNG and a variety of other file types. Whenever I make a video about a specific website tutorial, I recommend users to go to my website in order to convert their file types. The site has made about 400 bucks a month in revenue, and that's better than nothing. It's free money. And here's the actual application that we made. So for instance, users that go to this website, they can convert anything. It literally does everything. So we can convert uh, video and audio, images, PDF and docs, and also GIFs, and even other types like unit converters and anything else we can think of. So when you just go to our website, we place ads on them, and that's how we can make recurring revenue from this application. So those are five legitimate ways on how you can start making money with AI. The thing is, it is really getting competitive out there, so you really have to think outside of the box in order to make money with AI. If you want, I can actually build any one of these in the next video step by step. Just let me know which one you want me to build in the comments below. And if this video helped, make sure to give me a big thumbs up. My name is Daryl Wilson, and I will see all of you party people later.